Hi, it's Vinny here. I'm just going to talk about in this video how you're going to load the files in uh, the zip file that we just uh, released. The zip file contains the Tor 3.0, the Tor MTF, and as well as the Octobox update. So um, the current set of indicators will expire on 30th of June. Right? Therefore, you need to update your files with the latest version as well as to load in the Tor dashboard which is something that we just released all right so i have a clean um, platform here that means i'm trying to load my indicators inside uh, this mt4 all right but the process will be the same for mt5 so first you go into your file as in you go to the top left and you click on your file Right, you should see this open data folder so it should uh, pop up a window here and then go to the location that you put your downloaded zip file and I assume that you have already unzipped that okay so that's where I put my um, zip file and then I have unzipped and it's inside this folder here all right because mine is an empty file so I need to go and do two things okay I need to go to the Tor dashboard, all right, MQL4 folder to copy the two files that's inside your indicator. Copy that, the two files, and then uh, and put it inside your MT4, all right, MT4 folder. So for me, I just click, click uh, the back button to go to the place where uh, you're going to find the MQL file in your terminal, all right, so it must be in your terminal then go to the mql file and then go to the indicator folder right click to load that in okay but i like it to be a little bit more organized so for me i like to have a new folder so i like to say that this is a folder that contains my tor dashboard so it's easy for me to locate all these uh, files all right so i just put them into my folder which is a tor dashboard so the files are inside and I'm just going to repeat the same process all right, to go into my downloaded unzip folder under the Tor 3.0 MTF and Autobox. Then go inside the MQL4, go into the indicators folder, copy the three files because I need that otherwise the June version will expire. Right, go back and then I should be able to locate the um, terminal all right and that's my terminal so I just want to do it properly I go back and I see my terminal and then I see the numbers of my terminal I go to the MQL4 and I go into the indicators and that's where the whole chunk of indicators and the new Tor dashboard that I've just created all right and because I'm going to use the template therefore I will just paste the indicators inside here okay without create, creating a new folder I'm just going to place indicators inside here all right, I've just I've completed the process. Let me just close the window. All right, then go to the place that you're gonna see your navigator. Right click to refresh it. Okay, go to any empty place. Right click to refresh it, and you should see two things. One is the tall dashboard. Uh, the other one would be the new indicators that you're gonna click here. All right, so you're done already. All right, first, then next you have to you have to load in your template. So because we gave you the template. So you, you have to right click on any empty space on your chart, go to the template folder, go and load your template. Okay, so load your template and then go back into the desktop. Right, then choose the folder that you have just downloaded, go into the Tor 3.0 and then into the MQL4, choose the template and that's where we gave you the template here. Okay, so that's the template, open that. Okay, so once you have this template, it should be done. You have applied the template, everything seems like what you're used to. Okay, so the day chart, we have the Tor 3.0, then the H4, we have the MTF and the Autobox. Now last step you have to do is to make sure you save this template inside your MT4. So how, how to save that? Right click, go to template and save it. Okay, give it a name that you are familiar with. So I'm just going to say that this is a December template that consists of December uh, indicators. Alright, so I just click save. Okay, so with this, you can go to 
any other chart and then you have to just apply your new save template okay so you should be able to get that um, fix and the auto box in the um, US 30 as well all right then next question is that how do I look in the dashboard it's easy it's simple you can't look in the dashboard into any uh, windows or chart uh, uh, chart tab that you are uh, analyzing actively so you have to go and open up an empty chart that you are not going to actively use then what you do just do one thing drag the one that says tall dashboard without the buffer okay tall dashboard drag it in all right now the tall buffer you don't need to do anything just leave it there drag the tall dashboard into an empty chart then go to the input and choose the pairs that you like to include and you like to monitor all right and then leave the setting as per normal the only one setting that you might want to change is that you might want to turn the alert off for the moment all right until you have completed setting up okay yeah, i mean you can just leave it as true that's not a problem all right and every time when there's a signal it just going to pop on your screen to let you know these are traits that you can consider taking all right so just click ok right the, the dashboard will appear and it takes some time for the dashboard to refresh right if you want to make sure that it has refreshed and can refresh properly just switch the time frame all right just reinitialize to go to a different time frame okay like for example what i did is that the euro all right and the pound dollar isn't loaded properly because then it came up with empty value here zero so i'm just going to go to the h4 and to reinitialize it force that value out and then to resume back into my day uh, or you can just stick into the h4 chart so right now i have the tall dashboard already um, you can increase or uh, the number of pairs by keying in uh, the uh, pairs that you want but then that I will leave it to the next video to talk about.